Hey there Simulator fans, welcome back to the channel, Virtual Trucker here for another video and today we are gonna talk about Grand Truck Simulator 2 by Pulsar Gamesoft. I know it's been a while but finally they shared something for I think for the past 3 months or 4 months I think. But don't worry ladies and gentlemen because they finally came back out of another vacation. This is something that is not entirely new to us uh, from the developers Pulsar Gamesoft. I wish they could have done more for the game, you know what I mean. I know they deserve some vacation or time off but it doesn't mean that they need to have a vacation every, you know, next month. Well, yeah, the fans are eagerly wanting the game to, you know, to have an update and the most promising of them all is the new map which you can see in this picture I mean background right here and of course they also show the map which was you know been worked for I think for the past 10 months or 8 months I believe so yeah correct me if I'm wrong ladies and gentlemen you can also a montage of Pablo uh, doing the modeling of the truck which is the T800 I mean they already modeled this, you know, months ago, and I was wondering why it was being delayed. I mean, it's only one truck, you know, they remodeled the one truck in the game that is the Kenworth T800. I mean, they're not remodeling all the trucks at once. Well, the most hype uh, about the game's upcoming update is the new desert map because we were wondering where on the world is the desert map being situated on. They said in the US, well, probably it's gonna be in the US uh, judging by the coloration of it. But yeah, so that's one of the main, you know, hype for the game. I know we are accustomed with the slow progress of Pulsar Gamesoft I mean, uh, this is actually very relevant long before uh, they released uh, this game. We, When we were still playing GTS 1, I mean, updates of that game are very, very, you know, long to release. So once again, they are working on the T800 being implemented to the game with the new interior and so on and so forth with the desert map. They are also working on the reflection which you can see in this video right here. They are working on the new reflection which is going to make uh, the trucks look realistic by the way. I mean if you look before the trucks has only these static uh, colors. It does look cartoonish in my opinion despite being well modeled in my opinion. You can see it here. It does make a big difference. But yeah, then again, they already showed this together with the desert map and of course the Kenworth T800 Aero Cab. I mean, what's taking uh, the game so long to update? I mean, they already done this like months ago. And yeah, they already showed this a couple of months ago. So I have to cut that part because it's uh, part of the video which Pablo tries to, you know, endorse something. Well, that's what he actually is doing, but yeah, I have to cut that part because I'm not getting paid uh, when I show that in this video. So yeah. So another thing is, um, uh, that's probably it in my opinion. Uh, they also included the short, I mean the uh, day cab of the T800. How I wish they made this T800 the short sleeper or short cab. I mean, uh, the day cab does uh, have a short you know cab on it so yeah and then we have this 360 look of the surrounding of the new desert map so i just want to know your thoughts guys let me know down in the comment section below what are your thoughts about this i'm just glad that the pulsar i mean pulsar gamesoft is now back on working the game or making the game so this is something that i'm looking forward to and I guess that is for this video. Once again, guys, I would like to invite you over to join our official Discord server, Union of Simulators. Link will be down in the description box below. And of course, to all Facebook followers, do like my Facebook page at Virtual Trucker. Uh, I will also leave the link down in the description box below. We are close to 2,000 likes and almost 3,000 followers. 
So if you do have the time, if you have more time on Facebook, you can follow me there instead. Once again, this is Virtual Trucker. Keep on trucking and stay safe and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.